Hi there ladies and gentlemen. What we're going to do today in this video is learn how to set up a wet mount slide for our New York State Regents Living Environment Diffusion Through a Membrane Lab. So what you need at your station are the following. You need bottles of fresh water and salt water. You need a microscope slide, a cover slip, a piece of red onion, and a piece of paper towel. So this is what we're going to do. The first step in setting up a wet mount slide for viewing under a microscope is this. You're going to take your fresh water and you're going to add about two to three drops to your microscope slide. This will give the area for the specimen to sit in. Once you've done that, you're going to take your red onion. And the best way to do this is this. Flip your onion upside down so the white is facing you and the curve of the onion is pointing down towards the table and you're just going to gently take your fingers and then snap it in half and when you snap it in half try to peel it back so you can get the red onion film and skin to separate from the actual onion itself as you can see there all right so once you've done that just gently pull and you want to take a piece of that red onion skin and pull it off your onion after you've done that, you want to try to gently place it into your microscope slide. So I'm going to take this pair of forceps and carefully take this onion skin like that and place it in the water. Once you have your specimen in on the microscope slide, you want to take your cover slip and you're going to want to lower it down. So the best thing to do is to kind of stand it straight up at first and put it onto the microscope slide so it's touching and start to lean it on your pencil or pen gently. You're gonna take your pencil or pen and you're gonna slowly lower it down onto the slide. And to do that, you just wanna to to pull your pencil back and as you pull your pencil back, your cover slip will lay down. And we do this to prevent or reduce the amount of air bubbles that we'll see under the microscope. Okay, and then eventually you're gonna pull your pencil out and the cover slip is just gonna fall. All right, so this covers steps one through three on your lab. So right now I'm gonna ask you to pause this video and work on steps four through six. And when you're done, you can hit play again. Okay, welcome back. Now, what we're going to do is we're gonna work on step seven. Step seven is gonna ask you to set up your slide for viewing using salt solution. So this is going to actually going to be the part that's going to show you the osmosis that happens in the cell. So at this point, for number seven, what you need to do is this. You need to take your salt solution, fill up the dropper, or pick up the bottle, and you're going to put drops, let's say, on the left side of your cover slip here. Not on the cover slip, but on the microscope slide next to the cover slip. It is okay for the water to touch the edge of the cover slip because that's what we want. So you want to put it as close to the cover slip as possible. So I'm going to do one two, three, four. Once we do that, you're going to take your paper towel and you're just gently going to place the edge of the paper of the paper towel along the opposite edge, not where you put the salt water, but along the opposite edge and then just slide it so it touches the cover slip and you can see the water get pulled across. This is going to pull the salt water across the cover slip and then submerge your onion cells in salt solution for viewing for osmosis. Okay, if you see the water stop moving and you still have a lot on the left, then you may just want to move your cover, move your paper towel to pull it a little bit more. Now you don't want to get too crazy because you don't want to dry out all the water that's underneath the cover slip. So just keep putting it there and using your paper towel until you have most of that water that you place the left of the cover slip pulled underneath the cover slip itself. So that looks good enough. So at this point, you set up your slide and you are ready to do numbers 7 through 10. Now that you finished numbers 7 through 10, we are now up to step 12. Now step 12 is going to be very similar to step 7 in that we're going to add water to the left of our cover slip again, but we are not going to use the salt this time, we're going to go back to the fresh water. So the fresh water, we're going to take some, water, some samples of that, place it to the left of the cover slip, and it's going to be the same exact procedure as we did before. All you're going to do is add a few drops there, and then you're going to take your piece of paper towel and draw the water across again. 
So what's going to happen now is your fresh water is now going to flood your red onion skin and replace the salt water that you had placed there before. And you're going to keep doing that until most of this water, the fresh water on the left of the cover slip is going to move under the cover slip. And now you're ready to finish up your lap. So that's how you set up your wet mount slide and draw your solutions underneath the cover slip for the purposes of the lap.